What's going on guys, Super 9 and welcome back to another fantastic episode of Factions here on Minoria.net, yes. Uh, but basically, I just want to let you guys know something, this is really, 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 really extremely important, so please listen, please tell all your faction members, and all that good stuff. So basically, as you guys know, we've been having that issue with the TNT and the Creeper Eggs, sometimes they work, sometimes they don't, um, and that's within faction claims, right? So, basically, if you guys haven't noticed, we're having issues where, like, if you shoot TNT into, like, an enemy faction base, sometimes it blows up, sometimes it doesn't. Like, it will explode, but it won't do the block damage, if you will. Uh, same thing with the Creeper Eggs. Like, you can place some, but the Creeper Eggs don't explode within a faction claim. So, we think that that is occurring because we are using the most... Um, updated version of factions which is still in the beta stages so basically what that means is the faction developers the people that have created the factions plugin are still working on it and there's bugs and things in it and we think that that's one of the bugs so what we're gonna be doing on Wednesday is we're gonna be resetting factions not in the sense of taking items you know just completely resetting the world and all this stuff it's it nothing's gonna change in that aspect you guys are still gonna have your items you're still gonna have your bases you're still gonna have everything but uh, what we need you guys to do is make sure that you set home with your own faction. So work with your faction members and stuff like that. And make sure that you do forward slash set home space, you know, base name, whatever you want to call it. Um, and do that in your most important bases, including your faction's base, you know, your forward slash F home. Because that's going to get, um, the base itself won't be deleted, but the F home teleport will be. So you have to reset that. So basically all the factions will be disbanded. You have to reform it and stuff like that, uh, which kind of sucks, but... We're trying to fix it so that we can actually like, you know, do the rating and stuff more effectively because right now it's just like, it's like half there, half not kind of deal. It's it's really weird. So basically, um, we're going to be putting in an older version of factions that's going to be like the most recent, like stable version, if you will, that doesn't have any errors in it. Like uh, it's not in beta, I should say. That's probably the better way to say it. So that's going to be happening on Wednesday. It's going to be happening around uh, the afternoon East Coast time, which is United States East Coast time. Um, so just let your faction members know that we've been announcing it on the server since Sunday night. Um, I'll be announcing it today on Tuesday. I announced it yesterday on Monday a whole bunch of times, stuff like that. So just make sure that you spread the word within your faction, get set home set between all of you guys and stuff like that. Um, and all that, and then we should have it all fixed in theory, which will totally be awesome. Um, but anyhow, today what we're going to be doing is a chibi girl actually after the live stream made an awesome base. And uh, she actually recorded in it, but we're going to go check that out today. However, I've heard that it's gotten raided, so we might have to seek retaliation in a future video. <laughs> For raiding Chibi Girl's faction, how dare you? How dare you raid Chibi Girl's faction? She was just here. She was just, now she's all depressed and stuff. I mean, come on. All right, so let's do a uh, forward slash home uh, Chibi Girl. Also, um, one thing that I want to say, I think it's forward slash home Chibi. Your homes are not going to be deleted, and that's why we're asking you guys to do like the forward slash set home. So as you guys can see, like if I do my home list, right, or if I do home, right, it shows all my stuff there. So basically, um, that's what won't be deleted. Your F home, so like if I do forward slash F home, like that, it takes me to the Bacon Clan base. This is going to get... Um, deleted here the the teleport to it uh, the base will still be here but the teleport won't be here so we have to reset the uh, f home to be here so then we can do the forward slash f home and come here um but anyhow let's go back to chibi's base and check it out so she had this beautiful base man it was sweet like there was these blue things everywhere we had this nice little spawn thing built for her so that would uh the faction members teleported uh doing the forward slash f home you know they came here and stuff like that she had this awesome like um little walk-in area here where you could do um you know just your basic Minecraft stuff, you know, crafting, all that kind of stuff. And she had, like, these awesome, like, wood, uh, I can't remember what wood, acacia, is, is that how you say it? Right here and stuff like that, making it look like it was structurally sound and everything. It looks super sweet. Um, her room was built over here, which I think, I, I actually don't know who built the room. It was a combination of people. Um, so, like, Lady Cat, I know she built the bathroom. Um, we've got... This was Chibi Girl's bedroom here, which looks pretty sweet, uh, minus all the missing blocks. <laughs> I mean, you guys can kind of get a sense of what it looked like. Um, <laughs> let's see what else. We had this room here, which was somebody's room that looks like they kind of got destroyed in. Um, they had this awesome, like, party room, which let's go down in the party room if we can. Is it is it blocked up? No, it's not. All right, let's go down here. So they had this awesome party room here, which led down to, like, this cool, cool like, party wall that had all these lights and things. But uh, as you guys can see, like, everything's kind of messed up. We can't really get down there. There's a bounce pad, but we won't be able to get back up. Um, so we had that. They had an awesome, like, piston, like, bouncy house thing that, like, shot you up real high because the pistons would go up. 
up and down um, and everything like that. Let's see, what else did they have? This was somebody's room up here as well. Um, Meza Monster's room. Yeah, Meza Monster. So basically, this was his room, and uh, we got Inferno Mayhem's room. And uh, his room's actually looking pretty intact still. So basically, this is what I'm talking about. Like, as you guys can see, the TNT and stuff, it worked in certain areas of the base, but it didn't work in others. So that's what we're talking about. Um, it, it's really hard to do rating. So that's why we're going to be resetting here. And this is just a prime example. Like, they were able to get into this area here and break all this. If you guys remember, this was all, like, wood and stuff. And uh, there was glass here. If you guys saw Chibi Girl's video, which I don't think she actually put up yet. So I'm going to have to get on her about that. <laughs> but anyhow, um, basically, they were able to get in here. Um... And then I think they also were able to get in the back here. So let me let me run up here. I think you can get up here like this. And uh, there we go. So the person that rated it is X Bren Dog X. So he's marked. He's marked. His faction is marked. That's right. We're gonna take him out. Um, I don't know if this door was left open or something, but obviously they can get in here. This is looking very beautiful. Nice TV. I love it. I love it. Looks awesome. I wonder whose room this was. Oh, man. But basically, that's what we're talking about. Like, you guys can see, like, certain areas can be blown up and, and things can be mined out. I think these were actually mined out by the players themselves that own these rooms to, you know, um, get the blocks and move over. Because they started building another base for Chibi. Um, so, yeah. Basically, that's what we're trying to fix on Wednesday. <laughs> so, none of that stuff occurs and things like that. And it will be how it used to be. Uh, but, anyhow. Let's, uh, what's this over here? Whose floating room is this? Oh, this is fancy. This would have been fancy. Well, it was fancy. Um, but anyhow, what uh, I started doing is I started working on a vault. So let's do uh, four slash home vault, and we'll go over here like so. And uh, yeah, it's nothing super special. I was planning on working on it today, so I think what we'll do is I have some armor and stuff that I need to put in the chest. Uh, this was donated by a whole bunch of people while I was standing there at spawn. So shout out to you guys, whoever donated this armor. You guys are awesome. Thank you guys so much for all the free stuff, man. Um, and trying to think what else we got here. We got that. Uh, this can all go in there. I've got so much food. It's it's crazy. Actually, I need bacon. I don't want steak in my inventory. That's totally overrated. <laughs> all right, sweet. So basically, I, I I don't know. Do you guys have any ideas for design inside of the vault? Anything? Any any ideas whatsoever? I'm not totally sure. I think I might do like um some wood here or something. Do I have any wood? I've got some birch wood. We could do like do something like this to make it look fancy to divide the chest and stuff like that. I'm liking that actually. I like it. I like it. It looks like a zebra. It looks like a zebra wood. Yeah. <laughs> They're going to do that. As you guys can tell, I'm actually using a new uh, texture pack and it's um, Hawaii? Hawaii? I think his name is. Um, He's a YouTuber. Awesome dude. Um, if you guys haven't seen his channel, go check it out. But I'm using his texture pack and it's beautiful. I love it. Um, I'm totally jelly. I wish I had a pe texture pack like this. <laughs> but anyhow, um, I'm trying to think what else. I need to... What can we use on the floor? I think... You know what? Let's just use the wood. Because I got tons of this acacia. We need to burn this stuff up. So let's throw this stuff down here. And uh, we'll get a nice little vault going here. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to make an entrance in here. Just like I do uh, with all of my vaults. So if you guys find it, it'll be easy to get down here and stuff like that. And, um... You know, it'll be good to go. So then that way, if you guys find it, you can come down in here and stuff like that. Do some rain. Get all the good stuff that I have down here. You know? It's like, it's like a prize room, essentially, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Which is pretty sweet. So it's kind of, I, I like it, because it's kind of like a game for you guys, you know, to go try to find and hunt, you know, Supercharger 39's vaults and stuff like that. So, I mean, just just let it be known, I have a vault here on the new Fire Realm um, <laughs> and stuff. So, yeah, I, I'm expecting to get raided at some point. So if you guys want to go base hunt and stuff, I'll make it insanely obvious that there's a, a vault here and stuff. But, yeah, it'll be pretty sweet. It'll be awesome. And then I'll never know, you know. <laughs> like, I'll just come out of the server and be like, okay, my vault's gone. Awesome. Going to have to rebuild another one. Woohoo! Yeah. That's what I love about factions. You know, I love how one day you have all this stuff, right? And then you never know the next time you log on if you're actually going to have this stuff again. And that's I think that's what's so addicting to me about factions. Um, not only, like, the PvP aspect and things like that, but the aspect of... You know, you don't know if what you built today is going to be there tomorrow kind of deal. You know what I'm saying? Which is pretty awesome. I mean, I know a lot of people get, you know, upset when things happen. You know, if, if their bases get raided and stuff like that. I, I, I honestly am like, this is awesome. I, I don't know. I guess I'm just weird. I, I, I have no idea. But it's awesome. All right, sweet. So we're just going to keep on flowing this down like so and get all this in here. This is really orange. I feel like this is a Cheeto wood or something. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, it's just, it's like Cheetos are on my floor, which is awesome. The Cheeto floor for the win. Yeah, sweet. <laughs> I love Cheetos. Cheetos are awesome. I actually haven't had Cheetos in forever, though. Man, have you guys had Cheetos? Leave that in the comment section below if you guys have had Cheetos anytime soon. 
Ah, oh, Cheetos are so sweet. They're awesome, man. All right, so let's get this out of the way like that. Beautiful. Get that nice little floating thing out there like so. Get that right there and put this right here like boop. There we go. All right, sweet. Um, let me put that there, put that there, put that there. Put that there, put that there. It's looking beautiful. Coming along with the Cheeto flow. Looking great. Looking great. Oh, yeah. Oh, did I run out? Nope, I didn't. I thought I ran out of Cheeto wood. <laughs> the Cheeto wood. That's what we're going to call it. Who, who calls it a acacia? We're going to call it the Cheeto wood. <laughs> Cheeto wood, yeah. That's a, that's a new thing. It's a new thing. It's Cheeto wood. All right, I'm going to see if I can get this stuff and place that down there. Sweet, so it looks all uniform. Because this kind of stuff annoys me. Actually, you know what I could do? Wait, wait. I got a better idea, dude. I've got a better, 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 crazy, awesome. Ah, T! <laughs> oh, yeah. All right, so let's do a uh, 4 slash warp uh, space shop. We're going to go to the shop, and uh, I'm going to buy some glowstone. I'm actually going to put it underneath the chest, so then that way... Oh, uh, the glowstone's kind of hidden, you know, but there's light in the room. You won't be able to see it very well, which is going to be pretty sweet. So let's go over here to the block section and stuff. Oh, one thing I want to tell you guys is eventually here at some point in the future, right now we got some things ahead of it, but uh, within the shop, a lot of you guys want the, um, like a full inventory cell. So if you're trying to sell like a whole bunch of cobblestone, right? Like your inventory is completely full of stacks of 64 cobblestone. We're going to have a sell all button um, and stuff like that, but that's going to be in the future. It's going to be probably within the next few weeks. Uh, we'll eventually have it because I know a lot of you guys are upset with the fact that you have to like if you want to sell right you have to go or no wait wait I'm doing this wrong time out um, if you guys want to go to sell a quick sell quick sell yeah quick sell right you have to like click like 64 right obviously I don't have 64 but you have to do that and then when you do that it kicks you out of this menu and then you're like this and then you got to do it again um, so we're gonna have the sell all so all that goes away which is gonna totally be awesome all right so quick buy we want to buy uh, let's do like eight that should be good enough. So eight hundred dollars, man. That's eight hundred dollar. That's a lot of money. All right, so let's go home vault again. I could probably just do back, but whatever. That's overrated. Doing backs just who does that stuff? All right, there you go. See now it adds an awesome kind of look to the to the bottom there. I really like this texture pack. If you guys like this texture pack, let me know in the comment section below. I think I might start using this. Maybe modify it a little bit or something. You know, it'd be pretty sweet. It'd be pretty awesome. Um, I need I need an axe here. Give me one of these axes, oh yeah. I still need to work on those MCMMO tutorials for you guys, um, which will be coming quite soon. I've got uh, some ideas on how to get started and stuff like that. I want to show you guys some of the cool stuff that you can do with MCMMO. So we've got MC stats like that, because basically what it does is it allows you to unlock certain things. If you guys don't know too much about MCMMO, um, which is totally awesome. I mean, you can do some crazy stuff, man. It's going to be awesome. All right, so I think what we'll do is... Um, I'm going to put a, a nice little zebra wood right there, like so. And then um, I'm going to mine this out like that. And then that way, we can put chests along this wall, and it's all going to look uniform and stuff like that. So I'm going to have to do that to, to this side as well. So let's get all this stuff out of the way, which is going to be pretty cool. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to toggle my super breaker, which is part of the MCMMO stuff I was just talking about. See how quickly I can mine? It's part of MCMMO. It's beautiful. It's awesome. All right. So I don't know what's up with me and saying, it's awesome. <laughs> Uh, anyhow, so let's, uh, whoa, time out, dude, what are you doing? Oh, man, oh, that's not good, now I got tons of glowstone, sweet, um, let's go over here, put that stuff in that chest, and, uh, what was I going to do? I don't remember, I need to get more, um, stuff, I thought I had smooth stone, that's what I was looking for, sorry, I'm having ADHD moments today, guys, I apologize, there we go, this is my smooth stone, beautiful, all right, so let's, uh, fill this back in like so, I'll probably end up mining that out later, but, yellow. let's get all that in there like that, Get this in there like so. Beautiful. Um, that's probably going to have to get mined out just like that. So I'm going to leave that. Um, so basically, we need to go every two spaces. And I could be using trap or trap chests right next to these chests and, you know, make it all double. But I don't want to do that. I want to add, like, that awesome zebra wood flavor. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's just going to be an awesome zebra-filled Cheeto base. <laughs> vault. <laughs> well, I should say, not a base because it's a vault. But you guys catch my drift, you know what I'm saying? Which is totally awesome. The Cheeto zebra Cheeto vault. That's what we'll call this one. <laughs> oh, man. Wait. Get that out of light. There we go. Sweet. Awesome. So I think what we're going to do is I'm going to end this episode of Factions right here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If so, please leave a like down below. Other than that, Super Doctor 9 is out. This is really how we live.